guys, Mysterious Cat Island, back with more Let's Play Star Ocean First Departure. Sorry about the squeakiness of my voice there right at the beginning. Uh, we're on, and we're in a new kingdom, I guess, technically. Or about to be, once we get finished getting through these caves. Um, these are supposed to connect the kingdoms of Van and Silivant. Which sounds almost like Silverant, and if you've played Tales of Symphonia, you know why I find that amusing. Um, or at least of interest. No mm, man, I wish my heater was a little better. Like Starflare? Oh, that sounds like it could be a cool spell. Generic cave. Oh shit, it's got a branch and pathway. Ooh, a chest. Combo link. Eh, yeah, let's find out what it has. Items. Newly acquired. Combo link. Oh, okay. A bracelet that lets the wearer combine two special arts into an attack combo. That could be handy. Jesus, I got money. When did they get there? They've got us flanked. Really? How do they keep flanking us? Let's get as many of these out of here before Ronix decides to just start spamming spells again. Oh, good. He's, he's getting started, too. So much to survive in this world. Don't get me wrong, I like spellcasters. And Ronix is not a particularly squishy spellcaster, which is nice. Um. Oh, what the fuss, kitty cat. This should be a good test of skill. We can beat this guy. Oh, he's like instantly gonna- yep, there he goes. Instantly start spellcasting. Well, that's okay. It's a pretty good spell. <laughs> oh, I am certain it is already below freezing right now. I acquired seafood in a cave. Okay. A green barrel. I remember vaguely what those do. Whoa, it's snowy and shit. Whoa! Whoa! It's the Ice Kingdom. In Tales of... I, I love the Tales games, by, by the way, guys. In the Tales games, it was... What was it? Don't let up. <sighs> must protect all of us. It was Tales of Destiny... What was the name of the kingdom? Shit. It's gonna bother the shit out of me now. Fondaria. This is the Kingdom of Fandaria. Bam. There's, there's like an all ice kingdom in a lot of the Tales games though, so. Like there's one in Tales of Graces, which I didn't care for as a game. That's basically like Russia. It was weird. That game was... I had a lot of problems with it. Um, it's probably one of the few Tales games I will never play on the channel. Uh, we cannot ignore this. Can we? Weird green bunnies and these red Sonic the Hedgehog rejects. Yeah, Thundercloud! It's interesting how he does that. Um, although, as far as for the channel, I'll probably stick to GameCube and. Well, no, I'm gonna do Tales of Vesperia eventually. Um, because I love that game with all of my heart. What's up here? Is there a town here? Or is this a path into the mountains of cold? Whoa, whoa, is that a spider lady? It is! Oh, that's sort of cool! Uh, isn't it a bit cold for spiders? Her design's kind of neat, though. Yeah, cast silence on- ah, oh, shit. Got silence on Yashua too, which sucks. Um, cause he is my healer. Now, does silence disappear after this battle, I wonder? Okay. Let's see, looks like it does. Doesn't look like it's bothering me anymore. 
Okay, I thought this might be like... Oh, okay, there's a little town up here. That's nice. Enemy. It's nice to go in. I'm kidding. That's a Final Fantasy VII reference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My life is references. Nothing but references, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. I was hoping that was coming next. No, if you think about it, like, the ice world and a desert area are... It's... Oh, God. How does it go? It's... Normal world... There goes my phone again. Sorry. Ugh. I'm gonna sneeze. Uh, we'll do a private action later. I mean, you're somehow managing. Maybe we will do the private action. Let's see. Uh, I guess they're having a monster problem. Oh, good. It looks like, uh, Ronix and Ilya are having a discussion. Let's, uh, I'm taking a much larger toll on these people's lives, blah, blah, blah. Probably. So without losing faith, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, this town is tiny, at least. Lynn and her mom and dad went away somewhere. Uh, okay. It's not like you would know anything about that, Fea. I mean... Oh man, this is sad looking. Oh no, what a sad little town. Silvalant City. Whoop, tinnitus! I get this awful ringing in my ears and I hate it. What's in here? It's an item shop. Oh. So people are either leaving or being killed? Wow, that's... Yeah, this is a dreary, dreary place. Um... Gelatinous slime. You can buy it. It's apparently edible. I don't, I don't know how I feel about that. Oh, good. I can buy some stuff from you. I need a couple of blackberries. Uh, I don't want to check out yet. Let's go ahead and get two of those. One of these. Not thinking I'm going to use those. Uh, hang in there, people. Okay, I already talked to you. Let's go to the inn. Mavelle is here. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty sad looking here. Yeah, I know. I mostly wanted to talk to her. Oh, okay. There is more of the town here. Ain't nobody living in that house no more. Well, let's go in. Oh, man. It's so sad looking. You do that, little girl. Well, what have you got? Mm, not a whole lot of good stuff. Stuff. Handy stick! I know who that's for, actually. Uh, this is a character who always seems to use. The, what? Who? Wh who is this for? That's some bullshit, is what that is. Sorry, sir. 
I was still hoping you had something good. Okay. Well, I've talked to everybody. Ain't nobody had nothing to say. So, I don't know if maybe the private events in this game don't work like they do in the others. Yeah, we're working on that, Joshua. I'm going to come back into the town. Stay the night at the end, though. Yes, let's rest. Do we get an event? Or something? Hmm, there's music. Okay, guess not. Oh, your little girl's out building snowmen. <laughs> wow, this place is, like, really dreary. I don't, I'm not thinking these people say anything different. What's the point in coming here if it's like this? Okay. I mean, it feels like there's something I'm supposed to do here, right? Right? I, I guess not. I guess we just move on. That's really bizarre. Um, maybe we come back and do something here later. That's definitely a possibility. I'm so sick of these fucking fights. That's okay, these guys are decently easy. Uh, have an icicle right up the ass. Um, it looks like a diamond, actually. Ouch. I like bruise the muscle in my arm. Don't die, Joshua. Heal yourself, please. Thank you. Ooh, cold fingers. Okay. Alright. Yeah, I'm sure there's something we come back and do later in that town. Uh... Because the fact that nothing's triggering right now tells me there's just not nothing we can do right now. Enemies. Here they come. She looks like a spider centaur. Yeah. Is that a slow spell or a stop spell? Special effect. Well, you're gonna tell me what the special effect is? Well, Lavelle and Ronix can't, or Erotic can't use spells, but it's not like I'm busy with that anyway. Okay. My cold fingers. Thank you. Alright. Let's keep going. I'm assuming, based on the map, we gotta go around this way. Cause I do see a city there in the distance. We cannot ignore this, can we? It's the moment of truth. <laughs> oh my God! Why are you gonna do the icicle diamond spell on me? Uh, that was it. <coughs> oh, damn it. I need to cough, like, really, really hard. But I don't want to because it hurts. My sister has the same thing I do. And she actually, um... Separated her ribs coughing. And you know what? I don't, I don't want that. No! No, it really doesn't. Yes, that's fine. Go ahead, as long as you don't use it on Mavelle. Mm, well, never mind. It doesn't matter now. I want Ilya back at my party. I miss her. 
Maybe I'll try raw next to it. Phone! Cut it out, man. Stop spamming this fucking spell, assholes! Ah! Oh my fucking god, are you serious? Okay. You know what? I am a uh, party. There we go. I am going to switch out Ronix for Ilya. Because I'm largely tired of this sausage party. Now I'm going to have. Damn it. Two lovely bruiser ladies. God damn it. I'm trying to move the camera angle, and that's it. I promise. We cannot ignore this, can we? Let's take our time here. Let's see. Here it goes. More of this shit. At least we have Yashua to heal us. And yeah, me and the ladies probably can't knock these guys out as quickly as uh, Ronix casting a spell, but. Oh, never mind. That was way faster, because I didn't have to wait for him to cast the fucking spell. I'm so happy. Okay. Let's see. We should be coming up on the city any time now. No, I wanted to... <sighs> Go five feet, attack another thing. Oh, what a pain. Ow. Ah. Did I mention that I fucked up a muscle in my arms? Because I slept weird. Oh no, Yashua! He's the one who needs to have healing abilities. He's the only one who can't do without being silenced. Who can't do with being silenced. There we go. I know my words. Oh yeah, that looks like a kingdom. And this cold, frigid, desolate bitch of a land. And I'm fucking, of course, another fight. Enemies. Here they come. That's all this episode is, and I'm not cutting it out. I don't even care. Oh, you run at MP too, Yashua. Uh, there we go. Well, it takes so much to survive in this world. <sighs> I shouldn't be yawning, but I am. Because guess what? I'm tired. Uh huh. An actual event. Is that a fucking paper airplane? Are you serious? A paper airplane. There's something written on it. Uh oh. What's it say? Yeah, I'm curious now. <laughs> no. Roddick. Roddick, don't just run off. Tell us what it is. What was the matter with him? It probably has something to do with Millie. It does. What do you think you're doing? Big deal. The fact they gave that kid a face and a creepy one at that. Uh, don't be stupid. Why are you writing letters? You know no one's gonna read. Oh, Not Millie. I missed you. Oh. Millie. I'm trapped here, 300 years from home. And in the future, where we're from, everyone is still turned to stone. I never thought 
I'd be writing you a letter, given that I've hardly ever left your side before. And I would love to continue to not do that in the future. But I don't even know where you are. So this is all I can do right now. Oh. I hope you made it to the pass, okay? I don't know how many days it's been by now. No, girl, don't be sad. I want to see you. I just pray it'll be soon. I miss you. Oh no. <laughs> you crying, Millie? Yeah, I'm fucking crying. You don't know what she's been through. I don't know what she's been through. Ain't nobody fucking told us what she's been through yet. <clears throat> oh, this is horrible. I'm never like this ever. It's cause you miss him. And a lot of shit's going on. None of this would be happening if it weren't for him. Not entirely true. Roderick, I hate you! <laughs> As he comes into town. <laughs> He's like, what? Millie! Oh, he knows he's here somewhere. Roderick, I hate you! <laughs> oh! That's sort of cute, actually. Okay. You got me, game. Right. I don't actually hate you. Let me jump out the window to come see you, because I missed you. I like her color scheme. The, like, blue and white and pink. Thank you so much for taking care of me, ma'am. No need to thank me. I enjoyed every minute of it. It was like having my own daughter here. Oh my gosh, she sounds like my aunt. Oh, Judy. Come on, Lucian. Say goodbye to our guest. I don't know what to do with this kid sometimes. <laughs> he's He's got a portrait, so he's obviously somewhat important, right? Don't think twice. It's all right. I'd better get going. Hang in there, Lucien. Yay, I've got Millie back. Millie, are you really going? Uh, yeah, she's got to go back to her time, 300 years in the future. Yeah, I'm sorry. To save her dad and all that shit. No! Lucian, you're a big boy now. You should be sending her off with a big smile. That's right. I know. Good luck, Millie. Come back sometime, all right? We totally won't, probably. Of course I will. We'll play together again then, okay? Bye-bye. To be fair, the reason Roderick found you at all is because he dumped a letter out the window. I'm glad to see you in good spirits, Millie. Yeah, thanks for fucking abandoning me. You too, Ronix. <laughs> Sounds like a lot's been going on while I was gone, huh? Yes. A lot has been going on. We're finally within arm's reach of Asmodeus. Kind of. That we are. Asmodeus is the host of the petrification virus. If we can collect a blood sample from him, we ought to be able to make the medicine we need. Something like that. Well, in that case, we better go see those kings as quickly as we can. Shall we head for the castle then? Sounds like a great plan. What sort of mission are they sending us on? Yay, we've got Millie back fucking finally. <laughs> like, don't get me wrong, Yash was a great healer. But I missed Millie. Okay. What, are you playing with the snowman, sir? Like, if you are, that, that's cool. Um, we're actually gonna stay the night at the inn. 
rest. And we I'll probably need to upgrade Millie's equipment and stuff. But, seeing that we're 25 minutes into this episode now, we're probably going to do that in the next one. I did, thank you. Where is the safe point? Are these kitties? Kitties! Oh, it's a cat and a kitten. It's supposed to place around the old race known as the Spiritual Contract. Oh, lovely. That sounds great. Yep, that's cool. Bye. Alright. You know what? We're going to go ahead and cut it here because my fingers are fucking freezing and I need to finish making dinner. But thanks for watching, guys. We'll pick it up in the next one. We're going to go see the King of Sylvant Sivalant, and see what sort of shit he wants us to do. It probably involves going to protect that town, because that's the way these games go. So, thanks for watching, guys. Bye.